Om Tat Sat, this is Swami Nikhilananda and welcome to Spirituality and Vedanta Philosophy. My humble prostrations to my worshipful Param Guru, Sri Swami Shivananji Maharaj of Divine Life Society, Rishikesh, India and to my Guruji, Sri Swami Jyotir Mayananji Maharaj of Yoga Research Foundation, Miami, Florida, USA and to all of you Divine Souls watching this video. In my regular videos, I explain deep insights about spirituality and Vedanta philosophy. If you like my videos, please consider to subscribe and share my YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss, according to Vedanta, what are the three life-changing questions you should ask yourself. So the three life-changing questions, the first one you should ask yourself is, who am I? And why is this such an important question? Because a lot of times our perception of ourselves is very limited. Unless we are deeply rooted in spirituality, most of us think we are this body and uh, we give it so much importance because it's visible and it's external and all. And then we give importance to the senses and the world itself. Whereas if you go deeper and um, you introspect, you will see you are not this body. This body is more like your garment like you're wearing your shirt. The body is uh, transient, as we all know, it passes away. Um, but you essentially are Sat Chit Ananda, which means you are uh, existence, knowledge, and bliss absolute. And that is always perpetual. So therefore, you are the pure Atman. And that is the question that you should ask and introspect deeper uh, about yourself. And when you sit with sages and saints or read scriptures or attend satsang, these questions become um, clear to you. Second one is, uh, who is God? Who is Brahman? Who is that absolute creator? Why am I here? What happened? How come I showed up on this earth? So when you do that, you are asking the first question, who am I, which is helpful. And then the second question is, who is God? Who is Brahman? How did I come about? And what do I do about it now? This in theory then becomes your lifelong sadhana. This becomes your process to connect with God because we have detached from that hole and therefore now we are apart by detaching from that hole and just like any iron filing wants to connect back to the magnet that's really that inner yearning we have but the problem we have is we are trying to find that through the worldly uh, things by acquisitions by relationships by properties or whatever else you relate to but in an external sense so when uh, you start asking this deeper question you understand that um, none of that is needed really for your um, answer to connect with Brahman you really need to go within deep within to and find those answers and then uh, of course the third um, question is what is this world um, prapancha is what we call according to Vedanta which are the five things sat chit Anand, Naam and Roop. So Sat Chit Anand is, uh, Sat is existence, uh, Chit is knowledge and Anand is bliss. Knowledge, existence, bliss, absolute. Uh, and then uh, of course the other two are Naam which is name and Roop is form. So we, in and that the combination of this is called prapanch or the five things which make up now this whole world process. So we forget about the Satchitananda which is the consciousness itself that is doing all these things and we get stuck in name and form. And when we do that, when we are stuck in name and form, the problem now is that uh, we have disconnected from the truth and now we are more in the unreal uh, and uh, therefore we live our life very mechanically we experience stress uh, and all those things. So holistically, if you start asking uh, yourself these three questions, they will certainly change the direction of your life and you will experience more peace, more happiness, more contentment. And um, so the three questions again um, to repeat for you are who am I? That's the first question. 
who is God or Brahman, second, and what is this world process? Because if you have answered these three questions, really you have answered everything uh, that needs to be answered for your existence and your role while your breath is continuing. So the mission is to try to accomplish this goal and answer these three questions before we depart from this earth. I hope this uh, video helped you and um, I will keep bringing you more of these videos. In the meanwhile, this is Swami Nikhilananda, Om Tat Sat, Divine Blessings.